Hello everyone, my name is Raceland, and I am a tech support representative at CAD Dimensions, and today I want to show you a couple of my favorite new drawing features for SolidWorks 2024. SolidWorks 2024 will add a lot of handy features that will help even the most basic of dimensioning tools so you can complete your drawings faster and more smoothly. First, there is a feature that will allow you to highlight the associated elements of a dimension when the dimension is selected for easy reference. To do this, simply click Tools, Options, Document Properties, and then Detailing. Select Highlight Associated Elements on Reference Dimension Selection. Another interesting feature focuses on overridden dimensions. Now you can select the option to automatically change the color of overridden dimensions automatically. To specify their color, click Tools, Options, System Options, Colors. Under Color Scheme Settings, edit the color for drawings, overridden dimensions. To display the color, go to Tools, Options, Document Properties, Dimensions, then choose Highlight Overridden Dimensions in a different color. And if needed, you can also restore the overridden dimensions to their original values by right-clicking the overridden dimension and selecting Restore Original Value. Different from previous releases in SOLIDWORKS 2024, you will be able to keep the Link to Property dialog box open when you create a note in a drawing. Just click Add to keep the Link to the Property dialog box open. The dialog box will remain open as you enter more text or select another property and will remain open until you click OK or exit the note. On the more run-of-the-mill dimensioning side, you will also be able to keep chain dimensions collinear, and SolidWorks has made a more reliable way to reattach dangling dimensions, even if they're not all dangling the same way. The new way of collinear chain dimensioning will allow you as the user to select the option of best fit when dimension text or arrows overlap. For text overlaps, go to Tools, Options, Document Properties, Dimensions, Linear, then Chain Dimension. Under Collinearity options, select Offset Text Automatically when space is limited. In cases where arrowheads overlap, follow the same steps from the tools through Chain Dimension, but under Collinearity options, choose When Arrowhead Overlaps Substitute Arrowhead Termination Automatically with either points or oblique strokes. If you have a situation where you need to reattach a dangling dimension, right-click the dimension, then select Reattach. SOLIDWORKS will highlight the dangling point with an X on the first extension line, then select a point on the model to reattach it. These new detailing and drawing features are just a few of the many to really get excited about in SOLIDWORKS 2024.